For a bolted assembly with 8 bolts, the stiffness of each bolt is 1 mega newton per millimeter and the stiffness of the members is 2.6 mega newtons per millimeter at each bolt. The joint is occasionally disassembled for maintenance and should be preloaded accordingly. Assume the external load is equally distributed to all M6 by 1 class 5.8 bolts. What is the maximum external load Pmax that can be applied to the entire joint without exceeding the proof strength of the bolts? What is the maximum external load Pmax that can be applied to the entire joint without causing the members to come out of compression? This is the second example for the factors of safety for tension joints with the preload main video. The links to the first example and that main video are in the description below. We know that the load factor is applied to the external load only, which means that the load factor is guarding the bolt against overloading. Since the preload FI has already been set to be 75% of the proof load, which is the suggested value for a preload for a non-permanent joint, it makes sense to use the load factor instead of the yielding factor of safety. However, since we're trying to find the maximum external load, which means that we will assume a factor of safety of 1, mathematically these two expressions end up being the same, so it doesn't really matter which one we use. The maximum external load at each bolt will depend on the proof strength, the tensile stress area AT, and the stiffness constant of the joint C. We can look up the proof strength of class 5.8 bolt, which is a common material for the size, and we can look up the tensile stress area AT from the table of the book like we did in the main video, or by calculating the area using the mean diameter between the root diameter and the pitcher diameter like we did two main videos ago, link below. Using the table in this case, we find an area AT of 20.1 squared millimeters, which means that our preload is 5.73 kilonewtons. The stiffness constant of the joint will depend on the stiffness on the bolt and the stiffness of the members, and therefore the maximum external load at each bolt is 6.9 kilonewtons. This means that the total maximum external load, knowing that we have 8 bolts, is approximately 55 kilonewtons. To find the maximum external load without causing members to come out of compression, we'll use a factor of safety against joint separation equal to 1. Solving for P and using the values we had already found, we find the maximum load at each bolt of 7.94 kilonewtons, which means that the maximum external load at the joint that has 8 bolts is 63.5 kilonewtons. These values mean that the stress within the bolt would reach the proof strength before the members start separating. And of course, the advised maximum external load should not be greater than 55 kilonewtons. Thanks for watching.